American coins. Penny. It is worth one cent. It is the smallest denomination. It's made of copper-plated zinc. The obverse of the coin features a portrait of Abraham Lincoln, the 16th President of the United States. The reverse features the Union Shield. The penny was first introduced in 1793, making it one of the oldest coins in continuous production in USA. In recent years, there has been debate about the penny's continued use due to its low value and high production cost. Some have argued that it should be discounted, whilst others believe it is still a valuable part of the US monetary system. The nickel is a 5 cent coin in the United States. The obverse side of the nickel features a portrait of Thomas Jefferson, the third president of the USA. When it comes to reverse side of the nickel, that features a Monticello, Jefferson historic plantation home in Virginia. The inscription Monticello and the word liberty are also included. The nickel was first introduced in 1866 as a 5 cent coin made of nickel. However, it was discounted in 1883 due to high production cost and it was reintroduced in 1938 as a nickel-plated copper coin. The dime is a silver-colored coin in the United States, which is worth 10 cents. The dime is smaller than a nickel, but larger than a penny. It is made of copper-nickel alloy, giving it silvery appearance. The obverse side features a portrait of Franklin Delano Roosevelt, the 32nd President of the United States. The reverse side displays the torch, olive branch as well as oak branch, representing liberty, peace and strength. The design and composition of the dime have changed over the time the current design was introduced in 1946. The quarter is a common US coin worth 25 cents. On obverse side it features a portrait of George Washington, the first president of the United States. The reverse side typically depicts an eagle with a shield representing the United States. However, there are also state quarters, which feature a design related to each individual state. These state quarters were minted from 1999 all the way to 2009 as a part of a 50 state quarter program. Each state had a unique design showcasing its history, culture or natural beauty. The current series called American Woman runs from 2022 all the way to 2025 and features notable women in United States history, issuing five designs each year. The half dollar in US is worth 50 cents. The obverse side of that coin typically features a portrait of a significant American figure. The well-known is a Kennedy half dollar features President John F. Kennedy. The reverse side often depicts a symbol of sin related to American history or culture. The half dollar has been issued in various design and compositions throughout US history. The modern half dollar featuring President John F. Kennedy was introduced in 1964 to commemorate his assassination. American Bills The One Dollar Bill The front of One Dollar Bill features a portrait of George Washington the first president of the United States. He is depicted in a formal attire facing right. The back of the bill features a great seal of the United States, with bald eagle, the national bird and symbol of US, as well as unfinished pyramid of 13 steps topped by the eye of providence within a triangle. The design of one dollar bill has undergone several changes over the years, but the basic elements have remained consistent. The current design was introduced in 2013. The Tudora Bill The front of the Tudora Bill features a portrait of Thomas Jefferson, the third president of the United States. He is depicted in a formal attire facing right. The back of the bill features a scene from a signing of the Declaration of Independence, which took place on July the 4th, 1776. The scene depicts Thomas Jefferson presenting the declaration to John Hancock, the President of the Continental Congress. The design of the Tudoral Bill has changed several times over the years. The current design was introduced in 1976 to commemorate the Bicentennial of the United States. The $5 Bill The front of the bill features a portrait of Abraham Lincoln facing left. 
Lincoln is known for his leadership during the Civil War and for issuing the Emancipation Proclamation, which declared the freedom of slaves in Confederate territory. When it comes to back of the bill itself, that features the Lincoln Memorial, a monument dedicated to Abraham Lincoln located in Washington, D.C. The memorial itself is a popular tourist destination and a symbol of American democracy. The current design of a $5 bill was introduced in 2016. The $10 bill. The front of a $10 bill features a portrait of Alexander Hamilton facing right. Hamilton is known for his role in establishing the United States financial system and for his contribution to the Federalist Papers. The back of the bill features the United States Treasury Building, which is obviously located in Washington, D.C. The building is a headquarters of the U.S. Department of the Treasury. Similar to $5 bill, the current design was introduced in 2016. The $20 bill. The front of the bill features a portrait of Andrew Jackson facing left. Jackson is known for his role in the War of 1812 and for his controversial policies as president. When it comes to back of the bill, that features the White House, the official residence of the President of the United States. The White House is a symbol of American democracy and power. Similar to the previous two bills, that design was introduced in 2016. The $50 bill. The front of the bill features a portrait of Ulysses S. Grant facing left. Grant is known for his leadership during the Civil War and his role in the Reconstruction of the South. When it comes to bag of the bill, that features the United States Capitol, the building where the Congress of the United States meets. The Capitol is a symbol of American democracy and government. The current design of the $50 bill was also introduced in 2016. The $100 bill. The $100 bill is the highest denomination of US currency in circulation. The front of the bill features portrait of Benjamin Franklin facing right. Franklin was a renowned scientist, inventor and statesman. When it comes to back of the bill, that features Independence Hall, a historic building in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Independence Hall is where the Declaration of Independence and the United States Constitution were signed. The current design of the $100 bill was also introduced in 2016.